Monday I went to a really awesome event by Artisan Beauty. It was called the Pucker Suite in Orlando. They held a private event for uh, the beauty bloggers of Central Florida where we got to actually see the product, learn a bit, little bit about them, and they also gave us um, one complimentary uh, lip product. I would just want to say it was an amazing event. Um, basically, if you're not familiar with Artisan Beauty, uh, if you ever had a lipstick that you were like absolutely in love with but you found out the company has discontinued it, Artisan Beauty can actually recreate it. Not only that, if you just want to, if there's a color in your collection that you've been wanting and you don't have, you can actually make your own lipstick according to how you want it. They can even add lip plumpers. Um, they have different colors that you can make. If you want to add shimmers in it, if you want a matte finish, if you want it sheer, if you want SPF, if you want a different flavor, if you want a certain scent for your lipstick to have, I mean, they have it all. I want to say it was very awesome watching them, like, before your eyes make your own custom lipstick. And you just feel, like, a sense of, like, like it's your baby because you watched it, basically, from its inception to being born. Um... I had a lot of fun with my fellow bloggers and it was just really cool to see everybody's different creations and you can definitely see uh, everybody's different personalities based on the colors that they chose like with their lipsticks so that was a lot of fun too. They gave us these little goodie bags which included one of my favorite things. How cute is this pen? Oh my gosh it opens up like this. Hello, how awesome is that? It also had a cookie from Cake in the City, I guess, which sponsored them. But I ate it, so I don't have it for you to see. But I believe the website is cakeinthecity.com, so you can check them out. And it just gave a little pamphlet of information about the company. They also do uh, party packages that start at $30 a person, where they basically come to you and you make your own lipstick. The lipsticks start at $30 and the lips like the lip glosses start at 20 I think I think that's how it goes if that's the wrong information I'll put it at the down bar but it's just such an awesome like idea for like a little girl's night in just something different you know so that was a really cool um I definitely recommend it the color that I chose to make was like a purple lavender type of color because I feel like it's a color you don't really see too often. And this is what it looks like. I thought it was really pretty. We tried to add some uh, like gold uh, gl uh, shimmers in there, but they don't show up too much. I think the shimmers show up a lot better in the lip glosses. And uh, I chose like more of a matte finish with mine. I'm not wearing anything on my lips right now because I just wanted to show you. Oh wow, this is pretty hard to do looking at the camera. That's the color. The color is buildable, like if you want it to be brighter, well at least the one that I made anyways, if you want it to be brighter just, you know, put more on. And the lasting power is actually pretty decent. Uh, one thing that I do love about this is that it lasts a decent amount of time, but it doesn't dry my lips. A lot of times when you get lip products that have long lasting power, they also tend to be very drying and I didn't experience that my lips actually feel very moisturized so that's always a plus and I do believe that their products do have SPF in them so if you are um, really into that now you know um, they also did state that they will be uh, venturing out to also uh, custom foundation which I can't wait for them to do that because I would love to have like my own custom made foundation to match me 100%. So um, that was pretty much it. I'm trying to think if I have anything else that I'm forgetting. Every time I get on here I always forget what I'm going to say. But um, I think that's pretty much it. Anything else that I missed I will put on my blog and I will also put pictures on my blog for you to see. I actually forgot my camera that day because I was running around so all my pictures were taken on my iPad. I do have a little video where you can actually see my lipstick being created as well as um, 
some others that were already done, like how they put them in the lipstick case, so that's really cool. And I don't know if I mentioned this, the name of my lipstick is called Fantabulous. I did change the name like five times, but that's the name that I settled on. But it's definitely a great idea and it's so much fun. And I definitely recommend um, for you to check it out. And thank you so much to the owners of Artisan Beauty, Allison LaCour and Mimi Fox. It was so much fun and thank you for having us. And um, that's it. So until next time. This is four thirty six and Okay, I'm on the other side. It's on our side. Okay, okay, okay. So they won't charge us? Yeah, because that's that's not great. It's crazy. Like, we'll charge you. Nobody. I'm like, okay. Because we ate last time. Yeah, I mean, it's lunchtime. All the luxury upgrades. The safety in the car. Like, there are some. Yeah. Because I need a bus so we can all, like, mingle. Because, you know, the car is at the long run. It's kind of hard to be people. Yep. Yep. We can all, like, mingle. Because, you know, the car is at the long run. It's kind of hard to be people. Yep. Yep. They can be able to take the rates. The same frame. I was right the lyrics to a song. Oh, that was what the word was? Yeah. I guess I'm too